All right, in this video, we're going to see how we can merge cells in Excel and then we're going to see auto sum since sum is the function that we have to use a lot. In Excel, we're going to learn about the shortcut of it. All right, so let's first say that here we have the items. The items are mango, banana, apple, lemon. And then we have the total amount, total amount of mangoes, total amount of bananas, total amount of apples, total amount of lemons that we have to calculate and total amount of fruits per day is here. Then what are, what is supposed to be this place? This place is going to be, let's just write it here. Fruits per day from their day to Thursday okay now as you can see it does not look good so what I'm going to do is I'm going to be merging these cells and I'm going to make these cells into one cell and then I'm going to wrap the text okay so let's just do that and do that we're going to uh, go to our home tab and then go to alignment you will see a merge and center button first you'll have to select the cells you want to merge and then click on the merge and center as you can see it has been merged into a single cell all right and the name of the cell is the first selection cell which is b8 okay so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap the text before I do that I'm going to align it a bit more and then I'm going to wrap the text there we go all right so that is how you can merge cells in Excel okay now we're going to do our auto sum here now we know how to do sum by this time okay so to do auto sum what I want to do here is to uh, just sum up all these values in this cell so in this cell so what i'm going to do is i'm going to press alter and keeping on that press i am going to press on the equal sign and as you can see there is sum for cell c8 to c13 the formula is automatically applied there now i'm just going to hit enter and we have our sum here now say if I were to do uh, the same thing in this cell then Excel would have uh, taken it for from this cell which is C8 to the cell before the formula cell so let's just do that alter and equal oh, sorry about that let's just instead do it here there you go alter equal see that now this was our formula cell and Excel is taking all the cells from where the value starts till the cell right before the formula cell. So that is what is going to happen when you press that key. Okay, so that's one way of doing it. And then now let's do another way. What we're going to do is we're going to go to the formulas tab and you can see auto sum there if your auto sum isn't there just click on the drop down and then here you have your sum just click on the sum and it will do the auto sum what we have done till now okay now hit enter and it is done now this works uh, not only for vertical it also works for horizontal so let's just see here now I want a sum of these values of cells. Now let's just press on Alt, A, L, T and equal. And we have our sum formula uh, made for us. Now let's hit enter and it's the same as before. Now we can also go to auto sum again, click on that and it has been done. Okay, so that is how you can do auto sum and auto sum is in home. You can find auto sum in home tab as well in the editing group. There we go. We have auto sum and all the other formulas as well. Okay, now let me just finish this task. There we go. And now let's just do it again. Let's do it for here as well. There we go. So that was it for this video. I hope you got to learn something new. And thank you very much for watching.
If you have found the video to be useful, please like and consider subscribing to the channel as it will enable me to make more videos like this one. Thank you.